Even though we recently lit the menorah for eight nights during Hanukkah and the joyous holiday of Purim is on the way, the eight days of matzah crunching are soon to arrive thereafter during Passover, Pesach. The Hanukkah dreidel represents Hashem's open miracles of the redemption from the Greeks, hence the dreidel handle being on top visible to all. The Purim noisemaker, the Grogger, represents Hashem's hidden miracles of the redemption from the Persians as its handle is turned downward and unseen, covered by the hand. And Pesach, which celebrates when Hashem miraculously redeemed the Jews from Egyptian slavery before bringing them to the land of Israel more than 3,300 years ago, has two main symbols, matzah and wine. The classic holiday symbol, the four glasses of wine, drinking at the Passover Seder, represent the four phrases of redemption in this week's Torah portion, Va'era, which is Hashem saying, and I appeared. Then how can we use three pieces of matzah on the main dish on the Passover table, the Seder plate, and not four? One significance is that the three matzahs represent the three main roles in serving Hashem, that of a Kohen, a Levi, and a Yisrael, each distinct but all descendants of our patriarchs, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, all of whom are buried in the cave of Machpelah in Israel's ancient city of Hebron. Whether one is a Kohen, a Levi, or a Yisrael, each has important roles, and it's only through the unity and working together that what is necessary to our lives and to fulfill the purpose of creation gets accomplished. Together with all the symbols of the holiday on the Seder plate, the three matzahs are held together as one unit. This highlights the importance of unity. A Mishnah in Perke Avos, The Ethics of Our Fathers, explains that everyone has a role in Hashem's plan for unity in the world. When we unite our individual strengths, we better our lives and the lives of those around us, and we truly become liberated from what holds us back, especially on challenging days May we have the strength to reach out and unite with another. Sometimes, even when we are the ones searching for help, we may end up meriting to actually, and even unknowingly, help the other. Once again, showing the redemptive benefits of joining together and being bound as one. Just like the three matzahs, separate yet held together during the Passover Seder. Thank you to all our subscribers. Please leave me comments and questions below. And remember to click like, and most importantly, if you haven't already, subscribe and share the videos across your social media so we can continue to bring you new content each week. See you next time. Good Shabbos, everyone, and do your best today. You've traded a day of your life for it.